I am in Brussels in the layover. I just took a nap and I want to go out. It's uh, cloudy outside, but still an hour and a half until sunset. So there's plenty of light for me to make a vlog. Let's see, let's go outside. Let's see what's up. Let's see Brussels. <laughs> All right, ladies and gents, so we are in Brussels right now and I'm heading for the city center. I'm heading for some landmarks. If you're outdoors, you don't actually have to wear a mask, only indoors and kind of makes sense. I'm so sleepy. My nap was just one hour and a half, but still it's good, you know, otherwise I couldn't be able to walk out right now. I would just be like a zombie in bed which is not an ideal situation for the layover, especially if it's not evening already. So, it's fine. We have some sunshine. A glory de la infanterie belge. At least that's what it says there. That's a reference to the two world wars. Interesting place. It's a Ferris wheel, ladies and gents. It's a Ferris wheel. wake up tomorrow is just around 12 midday so that actually gives me some time to even go to the gym tomorrow morning if I feel like it but I'm glad that today I'm out I'm starting to get a bit hungry so I want to grab anything just the snack just something to eat We are finally here in the Grand Place. So this is basically Brussels' iconic place. is the main uh, is the main square here in Brussels, and it looks absolutely amazing. And there's a lot of cafe shops around here and all of this stuff. So it's quite cool to be able to feel like in the normal layover all over again. One of the things that's not so cool about Abu Dhabi is the fact that it's hard to really walk everywhere like a pedestrian so in Europe this is how it is you just walk everywhere you don't really need a car uh, you need a bike and if you do need a car you know it's for longer distances obviously but in Abu Dhabi where I live everything is a long distance away so I'm glad to be in Europe every single time because I get to walk a lot so guys I think it's just time to go grab something to eat to be honest ladies and gents so of course I'm in Belgium so of course I had to buy some Belgian waffle as you can see this one it has caramelized something and it's with bananas sprinkled all over it so I figured if I if I will have a waffle at least put something nutritional on it bananas ladies and gents it's a Belgium special <clears throat> all right so of course the waffles are done as you can see empty and it was really sweet, like really, really sweet. Now I'm not a fancy kind of diner. Like even even if I go, if I go out with my colleagues, yeah, sometimes we'll go to a nice restaurant and all of this stuff. But if I'm alone, I can eat anything. I can eat just stuff randomly. I can go to a supermarket and buy a casserole and have it. <laughs> like I'm not a fancy eater. I don't chase nice uh, restaurants and stuff. I think that's an advantage. An advantage for my wallet to be honest <laughs> anyway this uh, is a really nice day here I really enjoy my time um, I like to walk by myself good weather nice people good food good waffles I'll just head back walk back towards my hotel ladies and gents I'm gonna stop the video here yes indeed Brussels is amazing I'll keep enjoying my walk and uh, I'll go to the hotel room slowly slowly now, thank you very much, everybody, for watching. Don't forget to leave a like to my video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Until next time, my name is Alex. Bye-bye from Brussels.